In this video, we'll see how can we modify our EBS volume size, which is already attached to a running EC2 instance. So I have one EC2 instance, which is in running state. And there are two block devices. So one is root, this XVDA, and another is uh, this SDF, which is attached. And the size of uh, this volume is uh, 20 gigs. So let's say that I want to increase the size from 20 to 30 gigs. So first of all, uh, let me go to my putty. I've already logged in to my EC2 through putty. So I'll do DF minus H here. You can see I have, uh, you know, this thing, this block storage, eight gigs and uh, this 20 gigs. So this uh, broadly required two steps. So the first is uh, we have to modify the volume from console, AWS console. And uh, second is uh, we have to extend EBS volume from this uh, putty so that, you know, this should reflect the changes in our uh, EC2. So first we'll modify our EC2 volume size from console. So I'll right click here and I'll click on modify volume. So you can see that uh, if I want to modify the type of volume, but I just want to change the size from 20 to 30. So you have to keep in mind that you cannot reduce the size. So we had 20 earlier, we, we cannot make it 10. Okay, that require a separate steps. So I'll make from 20 to 30 and I'll click on modify. So this will immediately increase the size of our EBS volume. So this will give you a message. Are you sure that you want to modify the volume? You just click on yes. You can see that uh, they're also saying that you may need to extend the OS file system on the volume to use any newly allocated space. So I'll click on yes here. So just close this. So after a few minutes, you'll see 30 gigs here. So the best thing about uh, changing the EBS volume or I'll say increasing the EBS volume size is it this can be done on the fly. You don't need to stop your EC2 instance. So we'll wait here till this reflects new size of 30 gigs. Now this is done. Uh, we have the updated size 30 gigs. So let's move to putty now. Now we updated our block device XVDF from 20 to 30. Okay. Even again, if you type DF minus H here, you won't see the updated size. Okay. You have to extend this first. What we have to do is uh, we have to use uh, XFS grow fs command and then we need to give our block device name which is dev xvtf so you can verify that from the size here we are increasing from 20 to 30 so this is the block device name. so just click enter okay so this is done so now if you do df minus h you'll see this is 30 gig so one thing you need to keep in mind is uh, this command XFS grow FS could be different for different Linux distributions. So there's another command uh, resize to FS, which you can use if uh, XFS grow FS is not working. So resize to FS, then your block device name. So this is purely uh, depends on your uh, Linux distribution. Yeah, this is it from uh, this video. Thanks for watching.